I've learned to slam on the brake before I even turn the key. Before Hi everyone! Today we are going to deconstruct Lily waving through a window from Dear Evan Hansen. First of all, my shirt, tip of the hat. Center of the park with George! Because it's from the um, museum in Chicago. Neither here nor there. Okay, so the first thing, the, the, what we're going to overlay this song is, first of all, there are two tips of the hat to Wicked throughout the whole thing. On top of that, the other overlay is Ben Platt is amazing. So just throughout it, I'm going to be just pointing out some, a couple of Wicked tips of the hat, and then the entire time I'm going to be saying Ben Platt is amazing. So the first tip of the hat to Wicked is introduction, people. Sound familiar? The theme of it? What about this? When I meet the wizard. Tip of the hat. Tip of the hat. Okay. The next thing I want to give praise about is um, Bench Pasek. I always thought it was Pasek. Like Pesach. Any Jews in the house? Anyway, it's actually Pasek. It's not the point. I love that he does not rhyme plurals with singulars. Because that, first of all, it's not a rhyme. And there's so much plural and singular rhyming out there. It drives me crazy. See. So it's singular with singular. And where do I point that out? Because some, some, someone could say I've learned to slam on the brakes because some people use the expression brakes. He does not. He says I've learned to slam on the brake, which by the way also makes sense because you literally have a brake in your car. You don't have multiple brakes. The point is he says brake and then mistake. It's a singular rhyme with a singular. So budding lyricists, please keep your rhymes pure. Thank you. Um, then I love that, I love that um, Ben Platt just starts out so small, like you don't realize how amazing his voice is gonna get, but it's very, there's a lot of straight tone happening, which totally makes sense, because this character is like, oh, I'm shy, so why would it be like, curtain up? I love that it's totally straight tone and oh, I'm shy. But there's little essences of riff. Before I eat, before I eat, and by the way, those riffs, just on a side note, it's definitely a little bit of, um, my bar mitzvah. There's definitely a little bit of Judaica in those riffs, which I also love, but you're gonna hear that. Um, before I make a mistake, you're gonna hear that. Also. The first really fluid riff, before I um, uh, leave with the worst of me. So I can't do a fluid riff. But I love, worst of me. It's very, very fluid and delicious. Then, I love his um, sort of Pat of the Pwn scoops. Pat of the Pwn will be on the note she was on and then go to the next note. Um, give them no reason. Instead of, give them no, give them no. It's definitely tip of the hat to Pat of the Pwn. Anything else I want to say in this section? Oh, yeah. I also love that it goes... Um, so I got nothing to share. Now, it's a really long phrase. So I got nothing to share, which you'd kind of want to hold the note. So I got nothing to share. But why someone that has nothing to share would be holding the note for so long? So Ben, so, sorry, Ben. Ben, 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 I never realized how similar. But the point is, Ben is really smart because he goes, because I got nothing to share. It's just totally empty because he's like, I have nothing to share. So it's actually excellent mixing the acting with the singing. Is that all I don't have to say? Okay, here we go. I'm so excited. First of all, tip of the hat. When I meet the wizard. <laughs> okay, get that. I've learned to slam on the brake. Singular. Before I even turn the riff. key. Before I make the mistake. A little riff. First fluid Before one. Before I lead with the worst of me. Nice. Give them no reason to stare. No. Hear that? No slipping up if you now slip listen how straight. away. So I got nothing to share. Right. I got nothing to say. Okay, now it's tip of the hat to define gravity. How, Seth? Because, I don't know if you know define gravity, all this stuff is on the end of four. So it's like, by the way, I'm sure they were not like, we're gonna make like define gravity. I'm just saying it totally reminds me of it. And also, where's it and I? It just reminds me of it. So anyway, but look how it's all on the end of four. Uh, da -da -da. So on the end of four, I'm flying. One, two, three, four, and. One, two, three, four, and. And same thing. Uh, no, 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 say. Da, 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 da. One, two, three, four. There's all this and a four throughout the whole thing. Funkadelic. Okay, what else do I want to say? By the way, I'm actually reading my music. Normally I have it like all written out in a sheet, but I, I actually downloaded the music. But Which, by the way, you should pay for it. No bootlegging, people. Pay for it. I had Playboy pay for it. Neither here nor there. Um, uh, keep getting burned. Oh, yeah, I also want to say that um, Justin actually writes in a lot of the riffs. So there's there's extra Ben Platt riffs, but then there's stuff written in, like, uh, instead of going, keep getting burned, he goes, keep getting burned. So a lot of the actual scooping and riffing is written in the music. Just saying. Uh, define gravity, define gravity. Okay, here we go. You're going to hear it. I keep forgetting I have to push it down. 
Here we go. And... No, I got nothing to say. Step out, step out of the sun if you keep getting burned. See? Step out, step out of the sun because you've learned, because you've learned. So, yet again to find gravity and a four. Uh, now, he goes, on the outside, I was looking in, well, I. Now, what I was, of course, thinking is, what happens when this transfers to London? Because it goes, uh, evermore, uh, uh, will I ever be more than I've always been? Because, you know, in London, they, they pronounce it been. They don't pronounce it been. What am I talking about? How about in Avita when she goes, um, uh, she goes, uh, but that doesn't mean I should change my routine. But the original British lyric is, but I'm no has been, it's the same old routine. I'm just saying, I think when they go to London, I was experimenting. Uh, on the outside, always being seen, will I ever be more than I've always been? Then I'm like, wait, always being seen? It's literally the opposite of what the song is about. It's about never being seen. Oh, on the outside, never being seen. Hey, tip of the hat. You can see my lyric. Are you listening, Benj? Silence. Okay. Um, tap, 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 another tap. Now, what's interesting is that he goes, I'm waving. He actually adds an I'm here, which he doesn't do later. And I was thinking, is it easier for him to go to falsetto? I'm waving. Instead of just going, waving. I actually don't think it's easier. I don't understand why he adds an I'm. It's not in the music. Ben Platt, if you're listening, tell me why in the first verse you do, I'm waving, but never again. Curious. Here's the thing I'm the most obsessed with, the most delicious. It's not a rhyme. It's not a rhyme. It's not a riff, nor is it really a mordant. It's, I don't know the phrase for it. It's like a turn, but it goes, um, uh, for an answer to appear while, answer to appear while. It's the, but it's so much quicker than that. I had to rewind it a thousand times because I'm obsessed with it. Answer to appear while. Okay, listen to the fluidity of that turn. No, 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 no. I'm waving. He has the I'm again, and I don't know why. Get back, get back to me, uh, Ben Platt. Here we go. Uh, is this the next one? Oh, God, I don't, I don't quite know how to work this. I think it's this. Here we go. Yes. On the outside, always looking in, will I ever be more than I've, I've always been? been? Cause I'm tap, tap, tapping on the glass. Let me the I'm. I'm waving through a window, oh, I try to speak, but nobody Scoop. can hear, so I wait around for an answer to appear while I'm watch, okay, watch, watch, oh watching, watching people pass. Here, so I wait around for an answer to appear while I'm watch, watch, watching people pass. I'm. Too. Okay, I'm gonna keep going though. Can't keep obsessing about this. Um, now, what I love here is if I were writing the song because I'm not a composer on any level, not not creative musically. I can play something if you give it to me, but can't create anything. I love he goes is is anybody waving? Now, what I would do is because I'm a terrible composer, I go is anybody waving at me? But what they do is they delay it. Is anybody waving back at me? It's so smart. It's just so different than what I expected. Because I would be like, is anybody waving at me? Terrible composer. Okay, here we go. I'm waving through a window. Can anybody see? Is anybody waving at me? Back at me? That's how it goes. Terrible composer. Okay, the next thing we have to talk about is the amazing orchestration. Alex Lacamoire. I love how the strings come in slurred, and then after that, detache, anybody? But it's slur, and then it's detache. It's, so it's not even, it's not even like um, just, uh, you know, there's a slur where you, where you connect it with the bow, and then you can play like this, but it's actually detache, so it's much harder and harsher. That's what I love about it. Anything else I want to say about it? Oh yeah, oh my God, then it gets amazing. We start with stars in our eyes. Da -da 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 -da. But it's an amazing string part. Dig -dig -dig -dig. Obsessed with that. Thank you, Alex. Dig -dig -dig -dig. Happens twice. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, here. That's where we go. Is anybody waving back at me? Slur. We start with stars in our eyes. We start believing that we belong. Slur. But every sun doesn't rise. Yeah, Okay, then, you know, I'm obsessed with high notes, I'm obsessed with riffs, but I'm actually obsessed with Ben Platt's low notes. He sounds so rich on step out, step. It's just like so delicious. It's not like step out, step. It's so rich and delicious, his low notes. He goes even lower later, which we'll talk about. Oh yeah, then really, really smart writing. 
on Justin's part because it goes up. So as I'm out of the sun, because you've learned, it normally goes, because you've learned. But second time through, which I love, when something repeats, I'm always like, you've got to make it a little bit different. So instead of because you've learned, it goes, because you've learned. Really, really smart. So it's like, it's the same lyric, it's the same chord structure, but it's a tip of the hat to a melody change. It reminds me of, um, you know when baby, she goes, um, that her child will feel when I'm long gone. But the second time through, she goes, her child will feel when I'm long gone. I just like doing a tip of the hat, change the melody. Okay, uh, here we go. Oh, no. Step out, step out of the sun if you keep getting burned. My gravity. Step out, step out of the sun because you've learned, because you've learned. Okay, next section. 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 Uh, on the outside, oh, look at him, will I? Uh, you know, he's from New York, but he doesn't have his signature accent that I grew up with, where I would actually say water. He goes, um... Will I ever, ever be more? There's definitely a Julia Murney, Norbert Leo Butts, Emily Skinner. Not quite as harsh on the R's, which I love, but he definitely pronounces his R's, which I, when I was his age, not at all. So I just say brava for pronouncing R's. Uh, the tap, tap, tapping on the glass. Now there's no more I'm waving. Now it's just waving. But by the way, he actually belts it. Can't do it. But he just commits to it. Waving through a window. Oh, then Alex Lacamoire strings. Now I don't know if it's I don't know if it's all detaché. Yeah, just name dropping detaché. I don't know if it's bum 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 or if it's literally all down bows. You know, in Phantom of the Opera, um, uh, da, 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 ba, 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 ba. there's a whole section of Phantom of the Opera where they're all going down bows. It just is a much harsher sound. So I'm wondering. I should have asked Alex before I did this. But the point is, I just love bum gunk gunk gunk. It's either detaché or it's all down bows. I'll point it out when it happens. Yet again, that turn I'm obsessed with. Um, for an answer to appear, well, oh my God, I can't do it. It's so good. Why can't I do it? Why was I cursed with this trachea? Uh, wave me through a window. Oh. Okay, here we go. Because you've learned on the okay. outside, always looking ever? in, will I ever be more than a Wait, voice ours. been? Because I'm tap, tap, tapping on the glass. No, I'm right on it. Now, can about that for a Because it's not, it's not, oh, it's oh, there's a, oh, there's a, it's like a riff. So it's not, oh, it's oh, oh my God, it's so good. I love it. Hold on. Can I play this? Ah. I don't quite know how to work this machine. I think I did this. Did I just delete the whole song? Because you've learned okay. on the outside, always looking in, will I ever be more than I've always been? Because I'm tap, tap, tapping on the glass. Belt it. Waving through a window. Shake. I try to speak, but nobody can hear, so I wait around Turn. for an answer to appear while I'm watch, watch, watching me both pass. Belt it. Riff. Do you hear it? It's a combination of a broad and riff. Anybody Is anybody waving? Oh, I love this too. Is anybody waving? He doesn't do the back at me. It actually goes to the next section, which I love. Anybody waving when you're... And then it goes right into it. Okay, yet again, the low notes, the richness of the low notes... Okay, is that what I play next? Yeah, okay. Listen to the richness of the low notes. It's so delicious. Okay, here, let me just... I think I go like this. Is anybody waving when you're falling in a forest and there's nobody around? Do you ever really crash or even make a sound when you're falling in a forest and there's nobody around? Do you ever really crash or even make a sound? It's so low and so rich. So first I'm like, okay, wait, he's literally on a low A and then he has to go waving. I'm like, he's singing a two octave range in the song. Who else sang two octave range in a song with Crazy Low Note? Does this sound familiar too? Just a little touch of star quality. That's a low E. And then in the same song, she had to go to a, same thing as Ben, had to go to a high E. Okay. But then I realized waving through window modulates. So instead of waving, it has to go waving. It has to go actually, not two octaves, it has to go an octave and and one half step. 
Who does that? I'll tell you who. I'm not that good. Low E. But then, remember this? Tune So, I'm like, Adina Menzel does the exact same thing. However, not in the same song. So, Ben wins. However, I tell you where he doesn't win. His low note is an A. And I'm like, surely there's a lower note hit on Broadway. There is. But not by a man. That's right. Lauren Bacall, in applause, actually goes to an A flat. I'm not joking. People, this is on Broadway. Hurry back. It's no life at all. That's, he's on this note. She went to this. A flat. What's the note? Okay, that was a woman. That's not my point. My point is he sounds amazing on low notes. Okay, let me keep going to the next section. When you fall into parts, I don't know. Oh yeah, what I love is that the section keeps building. So you know, it's, it begins here. It kind of keeps, it keeps, the, the melody keeps kind of going up. It keeps in, actually, it's like um, chord inversions. You know, you learn that in theory. But what I love is that to help it build also is they added the vocals are coming in. As far as I know, yeah, Justin did the vocal arrangements, who actually wrote the music. The vocals come in to start building it. Here, listen. Oh, no, I have to do this now. When you're falling yeah. in a forest and there's nobody around, do you ever really crash or even vocals. make a sound? When you're falling in a forest and there's nobody around, do you ever really crash or even make a sound? Did I even make a sound? Did I even make a sound? It's like I never made a sound. Did I ever make a sound? So, yet again, two things happen here. A, tip of the hat to possibly Burt Bacharach. You know, Burt Bacharach was always inserting like six, four measures, you know, um, like uh, promises, promises, I won't do it, promises, promises, now, I don't know. So it's like, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. It's just crazy, six into three, four, into four, four. My point is, he goes, even make a sound, it becomes a six, four measure. Even make a sound. Five, six, uh, on the outside. But so that's the first cool part. Second cool part, yet again, define gravity because the chorus comes in on the end of six or even make a sound for five, six, ah. Uh. So it's yet again that end, which I'm totally obsessed with. Okay, so I want to point that out. Uh, can I read more? Uh, oh my God. Then the drums are coming in and I couldn't even really figure out their exact rhythm until it gets to this amazing uh, triplet. So you're going to hear it. It's so exciting. It just builds it. Okay, I'll, I'll point it out. So the first thing you have to hear is that it goes into 6-4, chorus comes in on the end, and then the drums are unbelievable. Here we go. Orchestrations are, um, oh yeah, are Alex. Also, uh, Chris Yonke did some, but I assume Alex did this whole song. I don't know why I assume that. Maybe Chris helped. Who knows? Here we go. Ah, oh, I don't know how to work this stupid ass thing. <laughs> Sorry. And it's like I never made a sound. I never make a sound. Okay, hold on one more time. Of course I counted it wrong. <laughs> wait, hold on, wait one more time. But I was right when I came in the end, but listen, listen, listen. Sounds like I never made a sound, I never make a sound. Isn't that great? Guns. Oh my god, do you hear that? That is such a great illustration. All the way up that was B flat. Now, I love the orchestrations here. They're going, um. He goes, you know, a waving through a window. I, uh. One, two, three, four, uh. I, it goes so well with the melody. Here, listen to this. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, uh, one more time, hold on, hold on. That turn. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. This is that good. And then. Now that's like that that riff. Because now he's doing full it's a combination of full vibrato and a riff. Oh, oh my god, it's so good. I'm sorry, I have to keep obsessing about it. Uh, can anybody see? Is, now, I didn't even mention this. 
there's so much great use of dynamics in the song. Dynamics means like louder and softer. So much use, and I'm sorry, I haven't brought it up, but it happens all the time. Like, I'm, uh, uh, is anybody, there's first of all, subito piano, subito means sudden, so, and piano means soft. Is anybody, ba -ba -ba bum is anybody, da, 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 da. it's really, really good use of dynamics. Okay, anybody waving uh, back at me? Okay, then he goes, is anybody waving? I have to say, it's a little bit, because um, he, he actually adds an N. He goes, is any, which I think, it's, it's so you don't have the glottal, you know, glottal, you don't grip it with the vowel, because I think it really hurts your voce. He didn't go, is, he goes, is anybody, which I, you know, is the same thing as, the wizard and lie, it's the same thing. And lie, adding the L, is the same thing as, is, is anybody, I'm just saying. Then, what I want, actually, well, let me just first play you that, because I'm obsessed with it. Okay, here we go. Um, okay, so, uh, first the, dyna the dynamic thing. Okay. Can anybody see? Ready? Is anybody waving back at me? Here we go. Ready? Is anybody okay. Niz! It's totally an end because is ow. Niz! Delicious. Here, listen. Once again. Back at me. Then, I love this. Straight tone. By the way, those are B flats. You know, here's the thing, it reminds me of like Lilius. When I heard Lilius and how to succeed, I was like, wow, she's belting a D. Then I got the music and it was an F. Like, I thought it was on a G. I don't know, those are B flats. Wave it. That's crazy high. But anyway, what I love is that he straight tones it. Wave it. Wave it. He has a vibrato. Delicious. Wave it. Then, the final thing I want to say is, well, here, sorry, just first hear that. I'm going to just keep committing about little tiny things that I love. Here we go. Is anybody Straight tone. Now this. Whoa. I didn't realize this. All in one breath. Whoa. Whoa. All in one breath. Same thing as Patty. With one look, I'll be me. All one breath. But he goes, uh, wait, whoa. And then, oh my God, the last note, the delicious release of the vibrato is so satisfying. Okay, here we go. Sorry. This? Ah, I knew I didn't do that. Can anybody see? Yes. Is anybody Quiet. waving back at me? Go and. Is anybody waving? Straight tone. One breath. In conclusion. It's all amazing. Peace out.